All right, Lifting Family, welcome back. So we have a review to do and I was actually reached out to by a company called Timu. So there's two products that we're gonna review one of them today and this product is actually of need. So I was given this product to review, to check it out and see what we can do. So we're gonna test some limits here. But the other piece is that we need this because when it comes to showing a product, the hard thing is kind of doing the intro clip. So what I wanted was something where it just kind of turned. And that is where this comes in. So, so we got this little turntable here. So essentially it plugs in and then basically it's just gonna do 360 degrees. We're gonna pop this open and then we are going to put it to the test with some weights. This actually comes with one of those adapters that I'm not sure the name of. It will plug in. So one of the downsides is that they, they're no longer sending the USB attachable wall outlets. So what I'm gonna have to do is move my little plug up onto the table so that we can get this plugged in. And I'm not seeing the ability other than just to turn it on to be able to adjust the speed. But as far as this one goes, 360 degrees as far as the rotation and then I'm not seeing where it can it can turn in, in two directions. So that is completely fine. My goal for this is just to display a product and that way when it comes to showcasing the, the start of the video, you'll be able to see it on here. But no adjustability for speeds, this basically just has on and off. So it does have a capability of 10 to 15 kilograms. So. Okay. I believe the conversion is 2.2 pounds. So this should hold just shy of 35 pounds. So we are going to put it to the test. I do have the kettlebells that we're going to try so they go in five pound increments. But we need this one plugged in and then we're going to see what it can do. So the cord for the turntable has to be on the table but also because of how my USB, my little three port USB attachment is, I need that on the table as well. All right, so the next step is gonna be getting this one plugged in. So we'll have Liam plug it in. So it just goes in the back port here. Got the little port, pretty simple. We're gonna have, so right now, so you're not gonna be able to see it black on black. Maybe we'll try it this way first so you can see it kind of turn. All right, so Oliver, you can turn the switch. This yeah, switch? That switch, so it's gonna turn. So it did kind of have a little bit of stick at the start there. Whoa! Whoa. Oh yeah, we're just going to display that the whole time. Yup. Everybody's favorite. And now for the fun part. So here goes nothing, so Oliver can turn it on. Alright, so we are off the center of the table a little bit, so you probably see the capacity of the table. Yeah, so when it starts, it kind of sticks. So, we'll let that go. So it goes in a clockwise fashion. All right, five pounds, carefully. Can you hold that? And then gently set it on the middle. It can move it. It can move the five pounds. I can just imagine it just like splits. Now we're gonna go for 10 pounds. So hold it from the sides. All right, we're gonna carefully set that on there. Okay. Got a little bit of noise coming in. We'll be quiet, Stu is walking. But it's, it's moving it. How much is this? This is 15. Oh, let me make me. Oh, it can. So it's not looking like it's much slower. It's, the noise between the 10 and 15 pounds is, is the same. So now we got 20. If it's not, it can move it. It meant the other way. So I'm not seeing. Why is it moving the other way? So the good thing is that it moves the other way. I, I don't know, I'm, there's no button that, that shows you the opposite rotation. So maybe when it lags, it actually, that's where you can kind of give it a nice gentle push in one direction or the other. 25. 
You go, Liam. It's starting to get hard. Oh, it's bending the table. What? Well, help the table a little bit. How? How? Oh, it's very, it's getting very slow, I feel like. I don't know that it's slowed down, but as far as this one goes, the, the table's, oh, we'll, we'll be hard. The, the table is showing some of its weakness, but at the same time, no, no increased noise from the motor. So 25 pounds, so this is 30. What? So now it's chosen the other direction. Oh. Maybe it's the weight of the table. You need to do a nudge for it to be able to move. So 30 seems to be pushing it. But it's moving. We'll go for 35. Oh my gosh. Right. It's not gonna. So now. Oh. And help the table. Help the turntable. So. Oh. oh. So it can't find its direction, so help it kind of on a full turn. It cannot do it. It's doing it! Oh. Okay. So, 30 is pushing it. And I, I think that. It's, it's true to form, so, so 30 is kind of pushing it. Probably wouldn't suggest 30 pounds on this, nor does it really look like it should support 30 pounds. But 35 is definitely too much. So it moves at the speed that it's supposed to. It does handle the weight capacity that it can. It was a fun experiment. So I'm still gonna give this a five out of five. It definitely solves a lot of problems that I have when it comes to showing the intro clips for products. So obviously I'm gonna make sure that I have something that is less than 30 pounds that I am putting on here, but it works out in my favor. Five stars from Lifting Dad. Again, this is a product that I was given to review it. I'd say that it lives up to its potential. I'm going to link it down below so that you can check it out on the TV website. If it is available on Amazon, I'll make sure that I link that down below as well. Outside of that, click like in this video if you like videos like this. Comment down below if you have any questions. Do also remember to click that subscribe button. We appreciate all your subscribers out there. The next up will probably be the next product from Timu, but if not, we might be having another snack crate video. I am not sure when that one is shipping, but outside of that, thank you so much for watching, and as always, keep pushing. pushing.